Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Sorry for being away for quite some time. I've just been on a very busy schedule. So yeah, on today's video, I'll be reviewing this Ultraman Reboot Hero Brave statue figure. As you guys know, I've always loved this figure. So yeah, I've got this for myself. Now you're gonna have to look at the box art. As you can see, the illustration on the box art are simple and beautiful as always. I really like the illustration. So yeah, that's all the details that you can have on the box art. So now I'll unbox this figure, hopefully you enjoy it, so yeah, let's go! So yeah, for this figure, it has nothing special like the Ultraman Tiga where it has this clear mold to hold the figure in. This is just a clear plastic just like the Ultraman Tiga, but it will do. So here's the other half of the figure, look at that man, wow, it's beautiful, I really like it, very very nice. And here's the other half, as you can see for yourself. The details is beautiful, but look at that. It's somewhat different compared to the rest of the Brave Hero. The, how do you call that? The fins? How do I call that thing at the back of the Ultraman? So the fin is hanging out, unlike the rest where you would thought it would be in one piece. So yeah, a simple join there and press there and voila. Look at that. And to my surprise, the figure could stand on its own, so you don't need this clear part stand for it to stand upright, so I'm happy. So here's the figure out of the box, I've examined it, I really like the details. Mine has no paint chips or paint leakage or any major defects on it, so yeah, I am really, really happy. And for this figure, it has a very nice clear part for the eyes, color timer and also the reboot blocker on the right forearm. So yeah, it is very very nice and the finishing is very clean. So you guys know I really enjoy collecting the Hero Brave statue. So yeah, I am really happy when I received this. I got it for a good price as well. So yeah, I'm just lucky. I really do recommend this figure to all the collectors out there, especially if you're a Malaysian, but I do understand that there are also some Malaysian that don't really, you know, feel the same way towards Ultraman Reboot, so yeah, I just like collecting Ultraman Reboot figure because first, I'm a big fan of Ultraman and yeah, Reboot is a representative of Malaysian Ultraman, so of course I will try my best to get all the figures as much as I can, so yeah. I really enjoy collecting reboot figure. I'll be comparing my Ultraman reboot here with my previous Hero Bridge statue. So let's go! So here's Ultraman reboot next to the Tiga Multi-Type and Gaia V2. As you can see for yourself, I would say the scales checks out pretty nice. If you're gonna say that reboot looks shorter, well we can argue as you can see, his pose, his stance is wider so of course he's gonna bend lower. But if you see in terms of body proportion, I would say they are pretty much in scale. So I would recommend guys getting this Ultraman reboot and post them next to the other Hero Brave statue that you have. And I'll also be comparing my Ultraman reboot here with the Ultimate Luminous that I have. So let's go! So here's the Brave statue next to the Ultimate Luminous. As you can see for yourself, both look great. Of course, both has its own pros and cons. As you can see for the Luminous one, it has the light up, you know, feature, but it requires a stand to stand up right. So yeah, it, was, it is a win for the Hero Brave statue where it does not require the stand to stand up right. So I always love this because yeah, it looks much more natural without the clear part stand to support them. So yeah. So guys, that's pretty much it for this video. I really hope you enjoy. Sorry for making a very short video now because I just, you know, want you guys to get entertained and 
as much info as possible in a very short video so that you don't get bored so hopefully you guys will stick around and support me as much as you you know have been i really enjoy making videos just that i can't really make them often due to the hectic schedule i have now so yeah i just hope you guys enjoyed this video so don't forget to leave a like comment down your Comment down below your thoughts about this figure if you want to get it for yourself or whatnot. And definitely don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.